Once I log in as a parent, I can click on the arrow next to my name and select my student. And so now I am viewing the course as my student and I can see that right here. Now I can also see all of the student activity, their recent grades, what assignment is overdue. So if I hover over it, it tells me that it is in this course right there. So I can actually click on that course and I can go see the course that my student will see. And I'm gonna go into first nine weeks and I'm gonna go into the second folder and I can look through the materials. Now they had a discussion question so I can click on that discussion question and see how my student responded. Okay, I can also see the grade here. I can go back to that same week of September 14 through 18. And if I click on Tuesday, I can see that my student had some assignments here and I can click on the Schoology assignment. And I can see that it was submitted late, but I can also see that it was given a grade if I click on the assignment that was submitted, I can see what my student turned in. Okay. Now, the next assignment in that week or in that Tuesday folder is a Google Drive assignment. And so, Parents will not be able to see any Google Drive assignments. So if I click here on Google Drive assignment, it's going to pull it up and I can click on my document, but it says private access only. Okay, so remember I'm viewing this as the parent. This Google Doc is only shared between the teacher and my student. So I will not be able to see this assignment. And you know it's a Google Drive assignment because you have the tab that says assignment and a tab that says my document. I'm gonna go back to that Tuesday folder. The last assignment I wanna show you is an assignment that we used the extension Cami for. And so again, I can see um, that my student submitted And I can also see what my student turned in. So here's what my student did, okay. And I also know that the grade says NA, so it has not been graded by my child's teacher.